we are starting the season three hours after the finale of last year. So we already have um, Sam in the hospital, Chloe in the hospital, and we have no idea where these characters stand right now. So it's gonna, you can really tune in and quickly see who's with who and what the, the drama is there. Um, and and you're, I guess you're joining the characters in like the most intense moments of their lives. Yeah, you really are. Uh, so it'll still be easy to understand, but I, I really like the season. Um, I am actually training a rookie, so they're not missing out on that kind of journey. Um, you know, the people who've obviously been following are gonna see a different turn, especially in Andy's character, but uh, you know, it's still, we still have the essence, the same, the same theme of what we started with, we still have it. It's people who are trying to find themselves, figure out who they are, try to be the best at their job, and and uh, growing and learning and making mistakes, and, and that's relatable through every season. It's, it's almost like a, a three-part, uh, this is the conclusion of a three-part episode, so it it's, uh, picks up in the direct aftermath of the season finale of season four. Uh, we just uh, found out that uh, uh, Chloe, for my character, we found out that Chloe is married and uh, her husband has the right to sort of uh, uh, take charge of her, her medical care. Um, ben is in the hospital, you know, it's uncertain whether or not he's going to live and what's going on with you and Nick's relationship. There's, uh, there's, there's a lot of questions that are answered, and, but then more questions that are posed in the, in the season program. I mean, it's complicated. Um, you know, Sam and Andy have more history, and, and there's a chemistry there that is very unbreakable. But they have not been able to, to prove that they can put in the time and work through their stuff. Um, whereas Nick and Andy have, and they have a great foundation of friendship and, and work really well. But at the end of the day, she really loves Sam. And, you know, you kind of watch Andy try to figure out what the best thing is to do and, and really uh, the most respectful thing is to just be honest with both of them and, and you'll see how that plays out in the season but it's difficult you know it's hard to care for two people very much and to be in the middle of that um, and yeah that's all I can really say. Missy Peregrim and boyfriend Zachary Levi officially tied the knot. How did they announce the happy news? They posted this picture on Twitter which shows each of them wearing Mr. and Mrs. hoodies. That is pretty adorable. Missy's caption included the hashtag married in Maui, so we may not have many details, but we do know their nuptials were in a pretty exotic place. Levi tweeted the image too with the caption, these dreams and goals are really working out. Uh, that is so stinking cute, it almost made me sick. Apparently their good friend Joel David Moore was in on the secret wedding. He congratulated them on Twitter for their stunning wedding and beautiful future, saying, couldn't be happier for my brother and my new sis pal. Uh, this entire story makes me so happy. We want to send our big congrats to the new couple from all of us here at She Knows, and good for you for keeping it so private. Really, we don't mind when you want to keep those very special moments in your lives to yourselves, but we wouldn't mind a little picture of the bride in her dress. Just saying. That's all for now, but keep checking back for more news throughout the day.